Hi. So first of all, as a future web developer, you have to know HTML5, CSS3, and JS, which stands for JavaScript, because these are the core of web development. It's like the heart of a human being. I'll take a moment and try to give you at least an idea of what HTML, CSS, and JavaScript are. Right now on the slides, you see the eBay website. Anyone with good knowledge of HTML, CSS, and JavaScript can make this website that will look exactly the same. As you see, the website has some menu items, then a picture with a pair of red sneakers, some search fields, buttons, and so on. So to create this website, we have to take several steps. Let's take a look at the first three steps. The first step is to use HTML. When we do this, the website will look like this. As you see, on the website there are menu items, the picture, search field, basically all elements we need. But the site doesn't exactly look as we need it, right? So with the help of HTML, we make sort of a sketch of the future website. We tell what has to be on the web page, which pictures, which menu items, links and so on. Then the second step is to add CSS to the website. And at last our website looks exactly as it's supposed to be. So by adding CSS, we stylized our website. Menu items, buttons and all other elements of the website have taken the right place and look. But if there are any dynamic elements on the website, for example a slider, a drop-down menu, at this stage these elements will not be working. To make them work we need to take the third step, which is adding JavaScript. So JavaScript adds interactivity to a website. It makes static elements dynamic. Just remember that if you see anything on the website which jumps, moves, spins or anything like that, usually, not always, but usually, that is because of JavaScript. So we add JavaScript and as a result we see that the slider now works and the drop-down menu works as well. Ok. I hope you've got at least an idea of what HTML5, CSS3 and JavaScript are. Well, basically that's it for this video. See you in the next video!